All right, everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Now, in today's video, we've got three mods that we're gonna be installing to the BMW 118i that I have bought from Wish. Now, these took about two or three weeks to come, which isn't too bad, considering from Wish, I thought it would take a lot longer than that, but uh, yeah, we've got three mods that we're gonna be installing today, so wait to the end, because the last mod is actually gonna be an interesting one, to say the least, and should change the, the sound of the car a little bit. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into installing these mods. Okay, so while I'm getting blinded by the sun, I'm gonna open the first mod inside. Now, it's gonna be, uh, a lucky dip with what we get out of the three so this is what i've picked up first whatever this is all right let me open this okay so all right there is a thing at the bottom okay the first mod that i've that i've purchased off a of wish so the first item is black bmw valve caps now they cost me less than five quid i'm pretty sure um so very very cheap and let's hope that they fit on and uh, actually stay on. Okay, so we have the first valve cap. You don't need me to show you the original valve cap. You all know what a black little valve cap's on. If you don't have a car, go check your bike. It's the exact same thing. But here is the, the new BMW one. Let's take this one off. And let's hope it looks the same size as the original one. But this will give it a nice little, little touch of class. There we go, that is on, look at this. Okay, there is the first little mod. Little BMW valve cap. That actually looks decent, I like that. It's a little mod, you know. You don't, you know, you already got a BMW logo there, M Performance, and another BMW, I actually like that. All right, let's now do this around the rest of the car and the other four corners, and then that is the first one, nice and easy, installed. This is probably something that no one will ever notice on this car, unless you seriously looked at the wheels. Here is the four logos. I've just cleaned this car, by the way. Um, and look at the wheels straight after. I've used so many different products trying to make it so it's shiny, all of that, and it still just dries and looks rubbish. I really don't like these wheels sat in black. But anyway, yeah, boom. BMW logo from afar. Decent little touch to the wheel. Nice. Let's get the second mod, which is lights now these lights go underneath the doors so when you open it it's like a nice bmw logo we're putting bmw logos all over this car today so um yeah let's open the doors and these should just pry out i've watched a video on how you how you do it and uh then these just take the old plug out plug these in okay so i've opened the driver door and uh if we look under here for the light wait, hold on Wait, what? There, there's no light. Um, just trying to think of the idiot who would have ordered a part which isn't actually on the car. We could just forget this ever happened and scrap this mod actually. Okay guys, so we are now moving on to the second mod. I've actually lost one of the mods. Don't know where it went, it just someone must have taken it. So we are now moving on to the third, um, we are now moving on to the second mod uh, and the final mod, which is, I'm actually looking forward to this, see, see what it is. Now, uh, to do this, firstly, what we gotta do is start my car up, give it a few revs, listen to what it sounds like, and then put the new mod on and see what it sounds like after that. Now, this should make my car sound insane and give it that nice little turbo flutter that we've always, always wanted. Now. Without further ado, let's go around the back and put this on the exhaust. Okay, so now we're around the back of the car. I'm going to give the car a few revs, see what it sounds like, and then we will install the new mod. So let me quickly go around and start the car. Let's now get this mod, which will seriously make this car sound insane. So here it is. I'm sure you would have all seen these uh, and seen how well they work as well. Okay, here it is. You open it and straight away you guys should know what it is. And it is a whistle thing, which should make my car sound like it has a massive turbo. Now, basically what you do, you put it in the exhaust like that and uh, then you screw it on, attach it, and uh, then the, the, the wind or something that goes through this 
makes a noise in here and makes turbo noises which comes up this little hole here so uh, let's screw this on and listen to it when it's on I'm actually looking forward to this mate because it should sound nutty so this is the exhaust you basically put it in like this in it goes um, in it in it goes all right, after about 10 minutes, I think it is on securely. We've had to do it this way instead. We've had to do it this way instead because this was just too thick to wrap around. So we've hooked it onto this little thin bit here. And there it is. There is the whistle that should be making the insane turbo noises. So uh, let's give this a start up and see what it sounds like. <laughs> actually doing anything they say though this is better under load so let's go for a drive I actually hear a whistle I actually hear a whistle boy I actually hear a whistle what the hell I didn't actually expect this thing to work hold on can you guys hear that hold on hold on let me put it eco pro so it's even louder definite whistle and big pops massive pops massive pops what is going on oh there's police oh Neil this is quite funny because it's so tragic thing on. I mean it's making a whistle but not a nice one. Not a nice one at all. This thing just sounds horrible. It sounds like it's... Oh. It does not sound like a turbo, I can tell you that much. I'm actually quite embarrassed to have it on. Okay lads, we've just made it back. We've now got truck. Oh, that is so hot. Oh, I just touched it, that is hot. Let me leave it then for a little bit. Um, and then, take it off. But yeah guys, that is gonna be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. The whistle thing was, um, well it worked. It made a noise, but it sounded broken. The car just sounded broken. So we're gonna definitely take that off. But yeah, the, the, the valve caps, as you can see, looking decent. BMW valve caps, I actually rate them, um, and then I was an idiot to actually buy lights that don't even exist on my car. So, you know, as I say, every time we do a video where there's mods involved, it's always something that goes wrong. But yeah, that is going to be it for this video. Leave a like and subscribe down below, and uh, I've got rubbish all over my hands from fitting that thing on the exhaust. Yeah, leave a like and subscribe down below. Check out my socials as well. Go check it out. Like all the, all the photos there. Be really appreciated. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Real quick, I've just got this out, and look how black it is just from that like 10 minute drive. Look, that's what, kind of what it was, nice and shiny. That's what it is after a 10 minute drive. And look, at the, it's destroyed. That is disgusting and boiling hot still. We can light up the sky, you and me tonight. See what we can find, come out to my guy.